Sure, World's Fairs have served as launching pads for all kinds of fun foods and inventions. And we've already talked about the history of the X-Ray and World's Fairs, but today we're going to focus on another medical marvel. But this one was conceived as a sideshow. The 1933 Century of Progress Centennial Exposition, more commonly known as the 1933 Chicago World's Fair, had the motto, Science Finds, Industry Applies, Man Adapts. Well, that was certainly fitting for one of the most unusual exhibits at the fair. Living Babies in Incubators. That's how the sign put it, rather bluntly, at the 1933 Chicago World's Fair. Unlike x-rays demonstrated at the 1904 fair, these incubators weren't being hailed as a medical breakthrough, at least not initially. Instead, they were part of a somewhat seedy sideshow carnival-esque part of the fair. For Martin Cooney, the man behind the exhibit, showcasing premature babies behind glass was nothing new. He'd started his infantorium at Coney Island 30 years earlier. And while his exhibits had traveled to various fairs and shows, it was the 1933 World's Fair that gave Cooney his widest exposure, with hundreds of thousands of people paying the 25 cent entry fee to see the babies. The babies were displayed in clean, sterile environments with several nurses attending them. Funded by the admission fee, Cooney didn't charge parents of the babies for treatment. After the fair ended, Chicago became the first city in the United States to announce policies around premature baby care. And less than 20 years later, incubators were common in hospitals across the nation, saving the lives of thousands of babies. We just had time to touch on the life of Martin Cooney and his incubators, but if you'd like to learn more, I'd highly suggest this book. It's called The Strange Case of Dr. Cooney, How a Mysterious European Showman Saved Thousands of Babies. We have Amazon and Bookshop links below if you want to check it out. There were a lot of new and unusual sights to be seen at the 1933 fair, but the public glimpse of the incubator had to rank near the top. If you liked this video, please subscribe to learn about the inventions, foods, and more that came from World's Fairs. Thanks for watching.